Hi everyone, good morning. It's Christine Lee, I'm Procrastination Coach. Uh, wishing you a happy holiday season and a happy end of the new year. I thought with all the running around getting gifts and preparing gifts and thinking about gifts that I would just use that as a theme today and show you how you can give five gifts to yourself by the end of today. Um, and there's my dog. So, um, here we go. So, first set of gifts is that you can give yourself, I don't know if you can see this, three items with intention. And that is to say to give yourself the freedom of deciding which three tasks to accomplish today. Things that you know need to get done, you know you need to put your thought and effort into, um, but really to kind of define those as things that you will actually get done for yourself as a gift to yourself to think of it not as drudgery or something dreadful or something that you're not able to do but something that you're just going to handle as a run-of-the-mill kind of event for today and to feel like you can celebrate at the end of that situation that you've completed three tasks with intention for yourself Okay, that's a simple and plain one, but here's another one. You can um, do one thing to remedy something in your life. So that could be something really small, like, like replacing a burnt out light bulb or calling somebody to, so that they can fix your sink, but something that has been going wrong or has not been working well in your life that you can take today and take 10 minutes, 10 or 15 minutes, and figure out a plan and implement that plan so that thing that bothers you all of the time, like too much light in your bedroom or something like that, that you fix that. You fix that problem so, again, you give that gift of feeling good in your life and also that feeling that you can take care of yourself. The whole process of recovering from procrastination is basically a long series of small steps that reinforce the fact that you are in control of things and that you can take care of yourself and that you love yourself well, that you don't let broken things hang around your life for too long and that you know when you see something you can actually handle it. You can turn it around within the space of one day. So final gift that you can give to yourself is one thing to upgrade your life. And I really love this because procrastinators kind of get into the sorry habit or the unfortunate habit of living with kind of less than quality items, less than a quality schedule, less than quality mood. And maybe there's one thing that you can think of today that can boost your mood, that can upgrade your situation. Maybe you can find something that would make your bedroom more comfortable. Maybe you could ease your schedule up so that you can do the work that's on the schedule a little better with a little more focus and quality. Perhaps you could get new blinds, which is what my husband and I just did and that just upgraded our entire <laughs> our, our entire living system. So, think of those five things to recap. It's three things that are just to-do items that you really need to get done so that you can feel better about yourself. To the second set is one thing to fix something that's broken in your life. The third set is one thing to upgrade your situation. It doesn't really have to be necessarily a task, but it might be a change of behavior. Maybe you go to the gym and you feel like that's definitely an upgrade to your life. Okay, so I hope that helped you make a good day going forward. And I hope you have a wonderful holiday and end of the year and vacation week and all of that. And I want to mention one more gift and it's something that I'm really excited about. I just put up a free five-day email course on my website. It's right now smack dab in the middle of my homepage, which is at procrastinationcoach.com. If you're interested in having really easy um, ways and strategies to transform your life from procrastination to productivity, I suggest you go and go grab yourself that five-day free email gift course, okay? And let me know if I can help you in any way. Connect with me on social media. I'm on Instagram and Facebook and Twitter as Procrastination Coach. I wish you all the best, and I guess I'll see you next week. Take care. Bye-bye.